The drama between Camila Cabello, Sabrina Carpenter, and Shawn Mendes has captured fans' attention ever since Shawn and Camila's high-profile split in 2021 after years of dating. Welcome to the News Flash Viral. After the breakup, Shawn remained single until the beginning of 2023 when he reportedly started dating Sabrina Carpenter. The situation took a turn when Camila began liking multiple posts by Sabrina and her friends, despite not following any of them on social media. This behavior raised eyebrows, leading fans to speculate about Camila's intentions. Sabrina seemingly addressed Camila's actions in her music video for Taste, where Jenna Ortega portrays a character reminiscent of Camila. When Sean and Sabrina attended the Vanity Fair Oscar party together, Camila responded by posting a picture that stirred the rumor mill. Shortly after, Sean publicly denied the relationship rumors. We are not dating, but I think he's talking about Tommy Hilfiger probably more than Sabrina, but thank you. Stating that his connection with Sabrina was never serious, despite their apparent intimacy. Sabrina responded to this in her song, Sharpest Tool, singing, We had sex, I met your best friends. If that was casual, then I'm an idiot. In another track titled Coincidence, Sabrina hinted at possible cheating on Sean's part with lyrics suggesting he might have cheated with an ex. What a surprise, your phone just died. Your car drove itself from LA to her thighs. Palm Springs looks nice, but who's by your side? Damn it, she looks kinda like the girl you outgrew. Indeed, Sean and Camila rekindled their romance during Coachella last year, only to break up less than two months later. Sabrina continued to address the drama on her Christmas EP, Fruitcake, particularly in the song Cindy Lou Who, and in Taste, where she sings, You wondering why half his clothes went missing? My body's where they are at. Camila, meanwhile, justified her actions as impulsivity and seemed unbothered by the controversy. On her album, Short and Sweet, Sabrina criticized Sean's communication skills, singing, I know you're not the sharpest tool in the shed, just because you talk like one doesn't make you a man. You're so sad, there's no communication. She even poked fun at his grammar in a separate track. Despite the tension, Sean was spotted liking one of Sabrina's posts shortly after she was seen publicly with Barry Keoghan for the first time. Meanwhile, Camila underwent a rebrand that fans claimed bore a striking resemblance to Sabrina's style. Camila later confirmed in her song June Gloom with lyrics like, if she's so amazing, why are you on this side of town? If you like her so much, what are you here trying to find out? Interestingly, just two days after short end, Sweet dropped, Camila posted a TikTok video lip syncing to June Gloom. Despite the ongoing drama, Camila and Sabrina were photographed together at this year's Vanity Fair Oscar party. Camila even dubbed Espresso the song of the summer. Espresso by Sabrina Car Carpenter. Yes, and honestly, I have been literally, every time I drink a coffee, I'm like, can I have some more Mi Espresso? Um, I, it can't be anything but a Mi Espresso. While Sabrina has yet to respond publicly to the latest developments, what do you think? Who do you think is wrong? Camila, Sean, or Sabrina? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more celebrity news.